New at 10 tonight, state legislators announcing a nearly half a million dollar grant to fund the State Route 115 safety project. The project is dedicated to creating a safer road design to alleviate speeding and traffic issues in the area. Fox 56's Alicia Hercules is live with more on what this grant will do for Bear Creek Village. Alicia. Aaron, Bear Creek Village residents have had issues with drivers speeding down this road here behind me and using the turning lane as a passing lane. But with this grant, state legislators hope to change that. Well, we've noticed some journalism research that back in the 1950s, they called this area a death trap. And a death trap is the way officials describe this area of Route 115, where issues linked to speeding and improper passing on the road have caused safety issues for drivers. Traffic that's coming to and from the Poconos and beyond are using this as their only way in and out of the Wyoming Valley. Getting this grant was a collaborative effort between State Representative Eddie Day Pashinsky, State Senator Dave Argel, and the Bear Creek Village Borough. Officials say that Route 115 has dangerous traffic issues with not just drivers from the borough, but outside drivers as well. There are thousands of commuters uh, that travel through this section on a daily basis. Uh, and this is just a really confined and constrained uh, section of road uh, where we have near misses with uh, potential head-on collisions almost on a daily basis here. The speed on the section of 115 in question is 45 miles per hour. A speed test conducted on that stretch of road showed that travelers were well exceeding that speed limit by over 10 miles per hour. Some changes that will be made in the project include adding right-hand turn lanes so that drivers have the ability to pull off to the side of the road to make a turn to avoid traffic behind them attempting to drive around their vehicle, which could lead to a head-on collision. And here, these funds will not just benefit the people of this community, but it will benefit anyone that's traveling on 115. This uh, roadway is heavily used. It's the direct way to the Poconos. And as a result, you need a safe roadway. Officials say that the project still has multiple design and approval phases ahead, but they look forward to making the road safer for everyone. Reporting live from Bear Creek Village, I'm Alicia Hercules with Fox 56 News, First to 10.